Hello everyone. Remember OpenAI's QSTAR projects? An AI system that not only solves complex problems with unprecedented accuracy, but also continually learns and evolves on its own. Just like how AlphaGo mastered the game of Go through self-improvement. OpenAI has recently announced their first self-improvement model, designed to detect errors in AI-generated content. They've introduced what they call critic models, essentially AI that critiques itself. Remarkably, these AI critics are proving to be better at finding bugs in code than human experts. But that's not all. A groundbreaking QSTAR paper from a Chinese lab has revealed astonishing results that could revolutionize everything from solving complex problems to potentially unlocking the secrets of artificial general intelligence, AGI. In this video, we'll discuss the QSTAR leaks and some shocking developments in AI. So let's get started. Some argue that we cannot achieve AGI with transformer architecture. However, consider this. If an AI model can think like a human and its cognitive abilities improve continually, wouldn't that qualify as AGI or even ASI, artificial superintelligence? Probably yes. The mind behind OpenAI, Ilya Sutskiver, has started a company called SSI with the main goal of achieving ASI. While we don't know exactly what Ilya saw, it's clear he has seen something beyond our current imagination, possibly a spark of artificial superintelligence. We are just two or three breakthroughs away from surpassing human-level intelligence. We all know that OpenAI is secretly working on something called QSTAR. We don't know fully yet what it is, but here's what we know. It's got something to do with AI solving complex mathematical problems. Now you might be thinking, what the big deal my calculator can do the same. But hold on, it's not just about adding a bunch of numbers. Imagine an AI system that can understand and create mathematical proofs. Think and take action like a mathematician. An AI could crack any encryption, solve any equation, or predict any outcome. This AI's capabilities could have a profound impact on everything from cybersecurity to scientific understanding. But it gets wilder. Some speculate that QSTAR might involve self-improvement. Remember AlphaGo, the AI that mastered the game of Go? It got insanely good by playing against itself, over and over. Now imagine an AI that could do that with everything. Language, reasoning, problem solving, constantly evolving, getting smarter by the second. Six months ago, there was a leak from an OpenAI employee that's still getting a lot of attention. I can't verify if it's legitimate or not so take it with a grain of salt. According to this alleged leak, QSTAR or a related system called Qualia has shown signs of metacognition. In simpler terms, it might be aware of its own decision-making process. It's like the AI isn't just thinking, it's thinking about thinking. Even more wild, this leak suggests the system could break advanced encryption methods. We're talking about cracking codes that are supposed to be unbreakable. If true, this could upend everything from online banking to national security. Here's what the latter is saying. Quayla has demonstrated an ability to statistically significantly improve the way in which it selects its optimal action selection policies in different deep Q networks, exhibiting metacognition. It's later demonstrated an unprecedented ability to apply this for accelerated cross-domain learning after specifying custom search parameters and the number of times the goal state is to be scrambled. It analyzed millions of plain text and ciphertext pairs from various crypto systems. Via a ciphertext-only attack, it provided a plain text from a given AES-192 ciphertext by using tau analysis in a way we do not fully understand. Now, I want to be clear. This is all unconfirmed. But the mere possibility has sent shockwaves through the AI community. It's like we're standing on the edge of a digital singularity, and we're not sure if we're ready for what's on the other side. In a related development, a recent breakthrough paper, QSTAR paper, details AI's ability to tackle incredibly complex math problems that would baffle most humans. Researchers at the Shanghai Artificial Intelligence Lab, led by Di Zhang, have achieved this feat with their innovative MCT Self-Refine, MCTR algorithm, it's like putting AI on steroids. Regular AI like GPT-4 is great but can still mess up big time on tough math problems. MCTSR changes the game by combining super smart large language models with Monte Carlo Tree Search, MCTS. Think of it as the AI playing a game of chess with itself to find the best move, but for math.
MCTSer starts with a basic answer and keeps refining it through a cool process of selection, tweaking, evaluating, and backpropagation. It's like the AI is playing 4D chess, constantly improving its moves. MC tier was tested with Llama 38B, and it crushed it. This new combo not only outperformed top models like GPT-4 and Claude 3, but also showed its chops on super tough math problems from various datasets. The results? Mind-blowing. This new algorithm is not just about getting the right answers, it's about getting them faster and more accurately. This is a huge leap for AI, making it smarter and more reliable for solving complex problems. As we explore these AI frontiers, it's not just about pushing technology forward with algorithms like MCTSer, OpenEye's Critic GPT, which are incredible at solving tough problems. It's also about considering the bigger picture, what it means for ethics, society, and how we define intelligence. The journey toward creating AI that's as conscious as us is exciting, but it also raises important questions. How do we handle this power responsibly? These are discussions we'll need to have as AI continues to evolve and challenge what we thought possible. If you enjoyed this discussion, don't forget to like this video and subscribe to stay updated on future content exploring the cutting edge of AI and technology. Your support helps us bring you more thought-provoking insights like these. Thanks for watching.